Uh, hello, everybody. This is... And welcome back to Franbo. Uh, sorry, this is coming out maybe a little later than normal. Um, we're gonna see how far we can get through part two of chapter two. Maybe try. Maybe if uh, this doesn't cross the hour thirty mark, uh, hit chapter three and see what happens from there. Uh, let's see, what am I doing? Oh yeah, there's Fran with a relatively cute hat. Oh, wait a sec. This is not my kitty. What a weird hat. in your bed, be nice and eat your food. Clara and Mia. Um, I guess that would be these two, up here. I don't like to be selfish, but that is my kitten. I like their blue dresses, though. Firewood to keep the chimney warm. Poor trees. Ah, and people say I'm the weirdo. Sounds like Dracula in the spa. Ugh. All right, the pine cone thing. Those cats are loose outside again. Okay, let's see what do we got over here to take. Oh, uh, hmm. cauldron, knife. Still got a crayon, baking powder. Honey, that's baking soda, not baking powder. There's a difference. And the exterminator card. Bottles, milk jar, dry flowers. Nothing of interest. Hmm, what's out the window? Oh, okay, so I can change that. A head from a human, I guess. Yep. Uh, let's see. What's over here? I won't lay down in that thing. Let's try to get out of here instead. Hmm. I kind of want to explore more, but I think we're just going to pop ourselves a couple crazy pills. Okay. Well. A secret bottle with a secret inside. Uh, that's a rock held on a rope, but uh, that's a corpse. Okay, uh... You're a clever... Hmm. Okay, I think we have a very good idea what this particular space is. Well, uh, I think we all know what has it here. Uh... Okay, so there is a bottle attached to that rope. Hmm. Uh, hmm. And I have no bridge. Okay. Let's head back down. Uh, yeah, we know what this little well has been used for, like, repeatedly. Don't we? Okay, so, uh, let's pop our pills back. Uh, and back into this house. Uh, anything else we can touch? A cooker to cook. My mommy told me how to use this. I don't like to light matches, though. 
This feels like it can burn my entire face. Ah, uh, well that's true. You could do that. Let's see. So, what do I need to do? I mean, this note said I need to eat food. I mean, pretending to be a cat for these two probably wouldn't be a bad life. I mean, you know. There's, like... Honey, I think we're kind of like 90% sure you're not on the pills right now. <laughs> Why is this part painted in black and white? Yeah, that is a little bizarre. Hmm. Let's see. I have no idea what I need to do. Hmm. Let's see. Alright, so let's just... I don't know why I need to close that, but judging by the way this thing looks, I'm gonna say I'm probably gonna need to have that closed if I have to light a fire. Alright, so I think I've got everything I can get here. Let's go forward. Um, hmm, okay. A lot of meat. Okay, I can activate that thing. A dancing teddy bear without its shoes. A plant. Great. Okay, so now I have a box of matches. God, honey, control yourself. What's over here? Hmm. Uh, some kind of funny bag, beans, salt. Okay. Uh, a weed. Uh, okay, some kind of weird seed. That's terrible. <laughs> that is a pretty can. Oats. Beans, rice, pepper. Garlic. Let's see, olives, squirrel body parts, okay, not the weirdest things we've seen so far. Hmm, well we know that was inside of the well on the other side, so let's pop our pills and see what this is. And we are literally where we were before. Interesting, okay. And back to not being high. Let's see. Hmm. What do I do? Is there anything else I can poke? Poke, poke, poke. Nothing. No. No. I mean... Hmm. Well, she keeps talking about wanting to make soup, so... Salt and pepper. Seed. So I guess I'll just use this with the water. this with that. There we go. Okay, so I have a pot of water. I guess I'm gonna have to make a kind of soup. Uh, let's save some water and turn that off. Hmm. How she's carrying a pot of water full of water in this purse? I don't know. <sighs> don't you just love video game mechanics? Okay, so... I'm probably going to have to cook back on there, but I'm kind of curious as to what's through here. I am kind of don't want to know, but I may as well. Okay. Interesting. What's up here? That's actually very pretty. Hmm. In the middle of nowhere. It's the Kami House! <laughs> I need to stop watching Dragon Ball Z, don't I? Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z. Wow! Interesting. Uh. 
Are those those two chicks who we saw who were in that room or back in the asylum? I have no idea. Let's keep poking things. Poke, poke. And I've stolen a vase with ashes. Okay. Just stealing random stuff. Blind pig. Uh, yeah, sure. It wants this to happen. In line to be burnt. Cozy and warm. Oh, look, food. Chocolate cake. Some flowers. Uh, candy. Caramel sauce liver. I think that's a flan. I don't know, the flan's coming that side. Cupcakes. Some kind of cookie. A teapot without tea. A tea cup. Huh. So, let's see. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, have I looked at all these pictures? No, I don't. I think I... Here we go. I missed one. Diet experience. Now that I don't have any. Okay, go on upstairs. Uh... Yeah, the goat looks angry, but uh, some goats normally do look angry. What's this? Pink and blue, complete opposites. Hmm. And hey, a broom. I guess we're going to shove that down into our purse. Yes. Okay. Hmm? Uh, I'm guessing that's for an attic. Um, black candles? Okay, that's a thing. Okay. What am I doing? I mean, this is pretty wallpaper. You know, I'm heading back downstairs real fast. Because, I mean, let's just make sure we're still in the well. Yep, still in the well. Heading upstairs. Interesting. Okay, so if we go into the other world while we're in there. Okay, so let's see. Where to go here? Hmm. I guess we're going through this house room. Let's see. Where are we? Uh, creepy bedroom. Check. Why is my reflection not there? Um, probably because this isn't real, sweetheart. Teenagers. Pair and stealing a pair of tweezers for some oddball reason known to man and monkey. Candles. Painting. So much blood. Yes, honey. With the doll heads and the roses. Okay, um, well, I'm sure if you play nice, it won't happen, so let's head back down here. Oh, shit! Uh, what? Uh, okay, um, that was kind of terrifying. Alright, um, oh lord. Uh, crap. Alright, well, I guess we're going up here. Uh, that moved. Those are nice. Ooh, Chinese doll. What the hell? Uh, huh. Okay, uh, you. Toys in the egg always give sadness in them. It's time to get up.
Uh, wow, that is creepy. Something's in here. It's you! Oh my goodness, my beloved friend! I found you! Friend, is there really? Oh dear, finally! <laughs> let me see you! It's me, come closer, please, let me see you! Friend, I'm so happy to see you! I missed you very much, I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you too, Mr. Midnight, and I really missed you. How did you find this place? You're way in the woods. I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost. My sons were too weak to track you. I recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. Oh, my dear. I'll get this... Oh, this case. We need to get to Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was a bad dream. I'm tired too, but at least now we can take care of each other. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure, Mr. Midnight. What is it? Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. Really? What kind of presence? Uh, for what I felt, it wasn't human, but it was really peaceful and kind. That's the real magic. Great to have someone else taking care of us, friend. Did you hear that? Did you? Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try to find the key to unlock you, alright? I love you. This is about to go banana shit sandwich, and I just know it. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is not good. Okay, uh, we're going back down here. Oh, okay. Oh. Waiting for you. Where was your head? Uh, my head. Oh, the cat hat. Waiting for me? Why? You, the precious being from the other world. Who would ever believe in us? Um, I'm confused. I'm very confused now, ladies. What are you talking about? Friend Bo, that's your name, right? Duh. And your mom and dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? Slow down. How did you know all this? We just know. We have to. We are part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us. All the time. Mm. I wish nothing bad had happened to me. I feel completely lost. But don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. Yes, with the pain I feel so great, I can't see solutions. Drink some tea, eat some cake, it will make you feel better. Um, thank you, but really, I need to know. Who told you this is Are you scared, little friend? Um, I'm confused. Of course not, I'm just curious, that's all. I'm mostly confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. Not for a girl who loves a cat more than anything else in the world. And yet, you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Should it be us trembling in fear of you? Uh, I love him, and that's why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? He's my... Yes, please. I really wish to have him back. He's my best friend. Pri, tell us about how it is you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place. A ugly place. They open up the heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. Phil told me a secret, and I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came in the woods and met a giant ant. And I killed a bug, and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted me to get his hair done. Wanted to get his hair done. And then I made a door, and that door took me here. 
but when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything. I, I saw a real pinecone family. That's where I came here. They live at Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. <laughs> They're just eating. <laughs> uh, and I saw flying insects that got stuck in trees because they have long hair. Also in the woods, and now here I am looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I'm 10 years old, but I have to turn 11 soon, and you? We are 16 years old. Much older than you. So you have to obey us. Uh, looks like either answer I choose is gonna be an asshole, so... I just wish you would open the cage so I can go home with my kitty. That's not polite. Oh boy. And you shouldn't wander around a house without permission. This is true. No family at all. Uh, let's just deal me Salad, please. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as I say, you and your cat will die. Ouch! Do you understand? Yes, ladies. I'll do whatever you need. Good. Now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a little magic trick for us. Do you like magic? Yes, Annie also did magic, but she didn't have any how to actually do it. It's tremendous and dangerous. Here is the recipe. Cautious and precise, otherwise terrible things could happen. Uh. Um. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. You mean you weren't born like this? One night a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it was not. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back. But we will do that later when we are not attached to each other anymore. And show him that he is powerless and he will regret it. That sounds terrible. I'll try to do my best to help you. We're going to gather some things you will need for the ritual. In the meantime, you can go and talk to your cat. But we won't set him free yet. Don't even try to open the cage. If you help us, we will help him. Thank you. I'll go and talk to him. And Fran, do you see this key? And what can be opened with it? Can you? Silly, silly girl. <laughs> Okay. <sighs> and I guess... Okay. Hey, achievements! Yay! Okay, so... No idea what I'm doing. Hmm. What's over here? Whoa! What the hell? Uh, hello? Who are you? Uh, can you hear me? I'm Fran. Yeah, I think that's not gonna work, sweetheart. Whoa. And the ghost went bye-bye. Uh, the smell. Poor girl, who could've done this and why? There's our buddy from before. It's on the shelf. Typewriter. Hmm. The paper. 
You had a good writer, so you know what to write about first. Yeah, this is true. As a writer, I normally have no freaking clue what I want to write. Okay. <sighs> well, after that little scare, let's head back this way. I mean, this is actually a very pretty setting. It's just... Holy crap! Who the fuck are you? But I haven't taken my pills, and he opened the window. Um... A bike. Hey, you! Yes, who's speaking? Me. I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. Yes, what is it? You're in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Uh, why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad. I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me. Every time I try to get out of here, I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad and cat magnet. They love us, but not to give us love. Just to use us. Don't trust them. Uh... That's terrible. That's why my kitty is here, then. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic, right? Uh, how did you know that? Did you see the dead girl in one of the rooms? Well, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried, but she did it wrong. But what should I do, then? I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I'd be creative. Creative. I'll try to do my best. Please save us all. I really want to get out of here. A big, big rock. Okay, so we're basically in this world's version of the Kami house, it looks like. Hmm. Oh. Plank of wood. Okay. Let's see what this is. Oh, sweet shit. This is gonna suck. Okay. Pill time! Okay. At least now I have things I think I can get to that stuff. Climb higher. It's just so convenient these things are like right there. Alright, so plank. Right here. Okay, so knife. Okay. I feel like I missed something, but oh well. What do I care? Uh. Okay, that's creepy. Okay, so I have these tweezers. Let's see if we can use that instead. What's this? Okay. A blue bloomed moonlight rose, salt and pepper, hair from the person you want to be witched. Hmm. Okay, interesting. Alright, so... Hmm. 